I look wilted. I've been in the kitchen cooking, and that's the warmest room in the house because it's the furthest away from our cooling source, which is here. The kitchen's all the way over there. Dad's going to call the air conditioning guy this week. So I'm like, you, I said, you do know you have to call and have our central air fixed at some point, right? <laughs> um, we went out to the... Well, I got new brakes this morning. My cousin fixed my brakes. Uh, so now, stop it good. Um, it didn't take very long either. Then we left and went to Myers to grocery shop. And my cousin was there who went business with I'm just going down this one way, uh, like in front of the cashiers, heading to the other end of the store. I hear, Sissy. I'm like, who, who knows me? Who's here? And him and his wife are grocery shopping. Uh, I bought stuff to do. Well, we had half the stuff for fajitas. We had a couple steaks left from the other night. I bought a little pack of chicken breast. It had three chicken breasts in it, which I put on the George Foreman when I got home and stuck them in the refrigerator to get cool. But a couple bell peppers, a red pepper. Uh, had a lettuce. They had lettuce on sale for 77 cents. Dad's like, I'm going to get two heads. That way I can make myself a salad or have me some peanut butter and lettuce sandwiches because that's his favorite, peanut butter and lettuce. And people always go, ooh, uh, ooh. But I did that when I when I was a kid. I'm like, that's gross. And I tried it. If you like peanut butter on your celery, pretty much the same thing. Only it's on bread. Um... I got the last item I needed to make Beth's from Cooking and Crafting Channel, the mini cheddar meatloafs. I'm going to try to make those tomorrow. I think I have everything I need. I need to write down the measurements, and, or I can cut, copy and paste it and print it out. I'm such a note taker, I just always go to pen and paper. Um, so I'm going to make that tomorrow, and I laid out another pack of my corn, my frozen corn. At least we have leftover Spanish rice, because I made that tonight, too. But after we got done at Myers, we took a ride along um, the highway that runs along the lake, and we went over in, in a town called New Buffalo. Hi, Jennifer. I was in your town today. Princess Miller. Hello. Um, I went to go see where that sushi place was, and I found it. Is it any good? If you watch this, tell me if it's good or not. And I see that they have bubble tea there, which really excited me, because I've never had it, and I've always wanted to try it. We took a ride down by the lake, and there was many, many people there. The parking lot was full. The attendant had to make people go by, because there was nowhere to park in there. Um, and we stopped, and we used a coupon in New Buffalo, and got ourselves a little custard buy one get one and we came home I did prep work in the kitchen I, I got all the peppers cut and onions cut and lettuce cut up and tomatoes cut up and I got the steaks and chicken I got everything cut up put in the refrigerator and then when I cooked dinner at like 6.30 everything was ready I love doing prep work I'm a nerd like that oh I know some of y'all asked about our creamy cucumber salad I thought I'd done a video on that, but that was the other cucumber salad I've done a video on. And there is no real, real true recipe. I don't measure anything. We had five cucumbers here, so that's what I used. We had two onions here, so that's what I used. You, you slice them, peel them, and slice them fairly thin. Not paper thin, but fairly thin. And um, you slice the onions. And then in a little, um, I'm frozen. How long have I been frozen? Come on. Okay, I'm back. I don't know how long I was frozen. I'm sorry about that. I ain't starting over. Ain't doing it. But you know those um, shakers you shake scrambled for eggs, plastic, whole lid? You know, that thing. Um, I just put in 
some Miracle Whip, a nice helping of Miracle Whip, some sugar, and some, a little bit of milk. You shake it up and make a dressing. And you do it to the consistency you want and the sweetness you want. It's, it's kind of all up to you. And sometimes I'll make one batch of dressing and then it's not enough, so I'll make a little bit more. It's just kind of a trial and error thing. Like when I did mine yesterday, day before yesterday, I put way too much milk in it in the because I, I too much milk went in there. So I had to pour the dressing into another bowl and add a little milk up and whip it together and make it a little thicker. And so that's all it is. Milk, milk whip, sugar, that's the dressing. Cucumbers, onions. And you have to let them marinate either all day or overnight. So good luck. Now I'm going to roll. i got to take off the over-the-shoulder boulder holder. Can't handle it no more. And i got to... This side of my neck has been killing me all night long. I hope it doesn't do it again tonight. You know the kind of thing where you look this way, you're fine, and you go like this, and you're like... <laughs> That's me. I can feel it right here. Maybe I'll put some, like, Ben Gay on it or something. I know I got something. I didn't think I was going to vlog since I put up a video earlier, but I don't care. I'll vlog. Because this week might be sporadic. I might not vlog uh, a couple days this week. You never know. Alright. I'm trying to think of anything else I have to add. I guess not. I just feel very wilted. I'm glad to be here in the cool room. Now, I just took my medicine. It is 7.18. What comes on tonight? Alright, bye.